Mystery Rally and first car due any moment now, Frank Mayer. Here he is, number one, Frank Mayer from Clooney. <laughs> Setting a very fast pace here. Needed at number two, Joe McHale. Number three driver gone through, Jimmy Dean. And here's Joe McHale, seated number two. Here's the sunbeam of Kevin O'Kane, number four. Number six, Vincent Mead from Cantork with his Escort 2000. Number seven, Lee McGrath from Mitchellstown, his Sunbeam 2000. John O'Connor, Mike Reeves, in a Chevette 2.3. Ned Flavin setting a very fast pace, seated at number five. Local man Gus Carney. Joe Butler from Carrick and Shore and his cadet. Ter Darcy, number 13. Jimmy Lambert, Mart Finnan, number 14. Tom Fitzpatrick from Carrick and Shore. Here's Jar Halley from Clammel and he's Escort. Here's local competitor John Hackett and Peter O'Brien sitting in. Number 18, PJ O'Keefe and John Fitzgerald from Kilmallock. Gone through there in a new escort with his son Mark sitting in. And here's Edward Kelly from Castle Comer and his sunbeam. Number 22, Luke O'Hara, having some, taking that bend very, very fast. Pat Morris from Middleton. Godfrey Kirby, travelling very fast in his escort. Are you enjoying the rally? No comment. <laughs> Jimmy Butler from Carrick and Shore and his Fiat 127. <laughs> Local man John Sheen in his Sunbeam and Declan Power sitting in. 
And here is local man Tom Sheen and his newly purchased cadet, Willem Walsh, sitting in the hot seat. Here's Richard Curran from Carrick and Shure and his S-car. Very fast as always. Number 29, Pat O'Connor. Dennis O'Brien and their Fiat 1283P. Willem O'Brien from Mitchestown. Our Mitchestown man, Toss McGrath. Taking some of the country. Stage three. Yes, Carter of Jared Darcy still travelling very well. The Avenger of Tom Hackett from Carrick and Shore. That car before was Tom Fitzpatrick from Carrick. Number 21, Edward Kelly from Castle Comer. Number 18, PJ O'Keefe and John Fitzgerald. Ger Halley. Number 24, Godfrey Kirby from Middleton. Coolman Johnny Sheen. Foley in his new escort. Butler in the one two seven. End and all twenty nine. Sorry, Pat O'Connor. Number 23, Pat Norris and Kevin Barrett from Middle. Tom Sheen and Willem Welch. Number 31, Willem O'Brien from Mitchestown. Escort 2000. Eckler as ever. Harry Mullen from Gilkenny. Number 32, Tass McGrath. Neil Perry, Colin Mullins from the tie. That's needing some help there. Number thirty four, Pat Lisi. Brian Allen. Number 
33, Terence Kearney, Gerald Loftus, Portlaw. Lair Welsh from Kerr. Number 41, Eamon Murphy from Wexford. Getting that bend all wrong. John taking some of the countryside with him. Hello, Tom. Testing. Here we are in Bally Macabre. And here I have beside me Tom Sheen. Tom, I'd like to ask you, how is the rally going for you? Going very well so far, no problems. No problem. Just to keep the car on the road, that's the only thing. How do you find the new cadet? Um, very easy to drive in comparison to the old escort. Just point it at the bend and keep the hoof to the floor. Good, <laughs> um, Where are you lying at the moment in your class? Uh, my navigator has gone off there just to find out. I think we're holding first. I think we're holding first in the class. Lovely. That's first great. in the group A, anyway. That was Tom Sheen. Thanks, Tom. Here we are talking some of the local talent here in Bally Macabre. This young lady here who is working in the local value centre. Can we oh, Excuse me. Could we have an interview? There's nothing but fine things here all day, including yourself, Declan. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> this is Willem Welch. She's navigating for Tom Sheen. Willem, um, Tom is just after telling us you went off to find out your times. Where are you lying overall now? I don't know where we're lying overall, but we're 57 seconds ahead of our nearest rival in the class. So you seem, how many stages left now? Three stages. Uh, so you're looking very hopeful? Happy enough, yeah. And what do you think of your new drive in this cadet? Uh, we're happy with the cadet. If we could get it up a bit off the ground, I'd say we'd get there. Big change from the escort? Uh, not much, really. It's going well. and I suppose it's been a group A, it's a bit slower than the escort, but still, we're getting there. Enjoying it. Okay, Willem, thanks very much. Thank Kevin O'Kane okay here. He's we believe he's leading the rally at this stage now, and we've three stages left. Kevin, how's it going for you so far? Well, the lead's not very extensive. It's just two seconds from Joe McHale there, and uh, it's anybody's rally yet. Have so you see? Have you enjoyed it so far? Any offs or no? No offs. Uh, stages are quite good. Not too sore in tires, and not so much road mileage. Generally pleased. And how's your navigator? Finding this trip. Oh, very good. Enjoying it, you Yes, enjoying it, yeah. That's right, that's Kevin okay in anyway. Thanks very much, Kevin. Thank you. By two seconds, do you believe you'll catch him in the next three stages? Oh, I say I would, yeah, because yes, you have a bit on with Kevin's sister that the first time we'd meet, that uh, she said that he'd beat me, but I reckon I'm going to win that bit. <laughs> very good, very good. Um, how's it going for you so far anyway? Had you a slow start or.? Well, that's the that's the new car's first time out, and I don't think that the car is handling that well myself. It seems to be sliding about a lot. I'd say the car is probably too high. But um, well, I'm sort of back in training again now. That's good. That's good. So you're hopeful of taking an overall here today? Ah no, I, if I finish second to Kevin, I'd be happy. You know, I'd be very happy. Yeah. Okay, the best of luck to you anyway, and yeah, hope you. to see a good finish. Thank you. So here we have Frank Mayer here with us. Um, Frank, where are you lying now? Do you think uh, with three stages to go? We're lying third at the moment now. 20 seconds behind Kevin O'Kane and 18 behind Joe McHale. We had one spin on this stage the last time, which cost us a bit of time. So, How do you hope to do in the next three stages? Do you think you're feeling you'll we've catch them? We have two good tyres in the back now. We're going to go all out and see what we can do. That's about it. Carl's going very well. And how do you find the stages themselves? Slippery or...? Extremely slippery. The first stage was the best stage. We'll go the quickest, but... I mean, Carey's Castle now is slippery as well as the other two here. Watching on stage one, you seem to be set. You must have set one of the fastest times. By a second to Kevin O'Kane, we were on the fastest. We didn't think we were pushing it that hard, but we had the advantage of a clear run. You started to slip back then into the later stage. Was it the spin? Um, that the second stage would cost us the time with a spin. And it was very mucky then there along. But um, there could be a few changes in times by the time we have them all checked in the evening. There's a few times there which are not realistic. Right, we wish you the best anyway, okay. Frank, and we'll see you hopefully at the finish of the stages. Thanks very much. The day going for you? That's 
going fairly well, but we're not too familiar with forestry, so we have to take it handy. But do you know where you're lying class-wise? Or well, we'll be leading the class by about two minutes, I think. So you look hopeful now to the finish. I'll we'll be hopeful that we can That's good. stay we on the road. The, we wish you the best anyway, guys. Okay. Thanks very much. Thank you. Dave Foley here with Dave. How's the new escort going for you? All <laughs> and um, you have the sun setting in with you. How's he taking oh, yeah, today? Yeah. He's like daddy. You know, he's daddy. <laughs> But yeah. um, overall, do you, you know where oh, you're lying in your class? Oh, I haven't got a clue. We're only out for the spin. Out for the spin. You're I never, drove, it I never anyway. drove the car before, so it's no fine. Problems. It's fine. Yeah, we had a few problems. We stopped twice in the stage. Stick that there. With, 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 ele with uh, electrical problems. Hmm? Um, this is this is Dave Foley, by the way. He's the f overall sponsor of the Foley Rally Championship, and um, Dave has another escort which he uses on the tarmac, and this one he, is his first time out today. Now on this escort in the forestry, and as he said himself, he's enjoying himself. So we wish you the best anyway, Dave. Nice we to hope to see you at the finish. Okay. Right, thanks, Dave. Bye. Yeah, bye. Here's Michael Shane, clerk of the course, going through for the very last time. Handling her very well. Joe McHale. First car through the last stage. Ned Flavin. Number eight, John O'Connor. With three stages ago was Kevin O'Kane. Hasn't come through yet. Gus Carney goes through now. Here he is, Frank Maher, local hero. Sounding very... JJ Senna taking it very easy towards the finish. through to the finish. Has he taken the engine out? And there's Ed Kelly. Well done, well done. And there's Joe Butler in trouble. Bit of damage done to the front there. <laughs> Number 28, Richard Curran. Carrick and Shore driver, Tom Fitzpatrick. And here comes John Sheen.
you. Did you enjoy that? <laughs> Have we any comments? <laughs> Do you like William O'Brien's driving? Peel him and eat him. <laughs> Tom Sheen and Willem Welch. Eamon Halley. Number 34, Pat Lisi.